Navaratri is coming now, that means Navaratri liter literally means nine nights. Why this Navaratri is? Every month after the no moon day or the new moon day as it's called here or the Amavasya, after that days are counted. Ninth day is called Navami, that means nine. Ninth day it is. These nine days are considered feminine. Out of the twenty-eight days, one and a half days or nearly thirty to thirty-six hours is a neutral time when the full moon is on. So twenty-seven days are the days which are calculated in a certain way. Twenty-seven days or twenty-seven is significant with reference to the solar cycle also. So one-third of it is called the feminine part of the month, the nine days. The remaining eighteen days are masculine in nature. So when it, the feminine is on, the devi's thing is on, so that is why in the tradition, up to Navami, all the worship is for the devi, after that things will change. Particularly, in uh, the tradition that comes from Kashmir, which is a, a very strong feminine worshipping culture, I'm talking about the past. <laughs> Today if we say Kashmir, you think of terror, you think of uh, militancy, you think of Islam, you think of extreme manifestations of many things, but this is all about started about seven centuries ago. Before that and even after that for quite a some time, Kashmir was a very strong <clears throat> Devi process and very feminine oriented practices, very powerful things were done. There are every Naomi, that is every nine days in this twelve months that is going on, they're dedicated to different devis. The one that comes now, which is called the Dasera, the or the Navaratri as it's largely uh, celebrated, this is dedicated to Devi Sharada. This was considered most important because Sharada is the goddess of learning. So among the various things that a human being can do, this tradition held learning as the most important that a human being can do. He can fight, he can win, he can conquer, he can run <laughs> But the most important thing that a human being can do is they can learn. That is the significant aspect of who we are. Other creatures can run faster than us, they are stronger than us, they can do many, many things that we cannot do but they can't learn like us. So this Navaratri, which is coming now, end of September, or no, beginning of October, I think, is dedicated to Sharada Devi, the goddess of learning, because this is unique to us. This is the pride of being human, that you can learn just about anything. If you're willing, you can learn. Even if they are willing, the other creatures cannot learn. So this is the most significant Navaratri dedicated to Sharada and uh, you must prepare learning something. <laughs>